Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Tuesday the 31st of January uh, 2023 and um, in the news I see uh, a, a, there is an, a, comet, there, a comet is approaching quite soon and uh, even though my audience for this channel is all extremely old excuse me <laughs> none of you are old enough to have seen this one because this one only flies past uh, every 50,000 years so we're talking about uh, first time modern humans have seen the thing um, so that should be exciting if you're a stargazer uh, coming up in the next couple of days it has the entirely unfriendly name of C slash 2022E3ZTF that's worse to remember than a Sudoku grid. Okay, let's get on with the Sudoku grid then instead, because I'm more likely to uh, um, enjoy that than I am the uh, heavenly body. <laughs> uh, I've lost myself now. Where am I? Uh, okay, let's have a quick start with ones, shall we? I see one blocking down here and across here and across here. That's going to give me the first digit. Let's stick a one there. We have one up here. One down here and one across here. I'm very full, by the way. I've just been for dinner uh, with Japanese food. And although I've been on a trying to eat, re not exactly a diet, but trying to eat less um, recently, uh, it all failed this evening and I've eaten far too much. Um, one and six, one and six. That's going to give me one and six up there, isn't it? So what does that mean? Uh, we have a two, so the twos are like so. Does that help? No, but on the other hand, twos across this way certainly does help. Um, what was I saying? Twos like this. Anything else? Not sure. How about the ones? We have ones like this. We have ones over here. Uh, no, I guess not. Okay. Um, sixes. Six like this. So, this six blocks here. So that means we definitely have six in one of these two squares here. How does that help? Where else? We have sixes here. We have sixes here. A pair of sixes like that. Hmm, not sure about this bit in the middle though. Uh, right, one, two, seven blocks up here and seven blocks across there. So we have a pair of sevens there. We've got seven here now then, so two and seven here. And... Then with threes, threes in these squares. Ah, no. Okay, we have three blocking down here and across here, so three in those squares. This can't be three here. Three across, three across here. Here's a three then. I'm really full. <laughs> Never play Sudoku on a full stomach. It could be dangerous. Seven across here and seven down here. So there's a... Oh, excuse me. Uh, sorry about that. I, in fact, have my telephone um, switched on I'm manning the phones at the moment making sure that um, uh, if a call comes in I answer it um, so I've got the sound switched on normally I don't do that when I'm playing Sudoku the sound is normally off anyway uh, now we have three blocking across here now so that gives us a three there and so the three blocks this square this square one blocking here and one blocking here so that's going to put a three over there. Oh, mosquitoes in the room too. 
Uh, right, missing numbers here are eight. Here's a blocking eight, so let's put the eight there. And the other number is a four. So four up here and across these two rows, we get to put four there. Nine blocks this square here, so that has to be a nine for this row. Five finishes the row. All right, let's go on a search. Seven now is in those squares and those squares and these squares and those squares. Here though, I'm not so sure. Ah, I see something though. I see the eights blocking across here now. Okay, so eight in that square, eight and four block down here. So that's eight and four there. This has to be a five then. So five in these squares, these squares. Hmm. So seven is somewhere across the middle now. Seven's like this. Seven here, seven there. Uh, so this is a pair of 9 and 5 up here, if that means anything. I'm not sure it does. And this is also a pair of 9 and 5. We've got 9 and 5 blocking up here, so that puts them there, and 9 and 5 blocking across here. So we've got 9 and 5 in these squares highlighted in blue. 
Right. Let's see if we can do something about it then. I don't know what we can do, but <laughs> let's see. So the missing digit here and here is two and seven. And we already know this is one and six up here, don't we? Okay, two and seven. Do I know anything about that? The twos, the sevens, seven across there, two. I'm not sure about the twos. Uh, okay, so the missing digits up here, um, this is nine and five, so this has to be seven and eight. So we've got seven across here. There's the seven, and there goes the eight. Um, if we know that this is one and six, we will be left here with two, five, and nine. And I see the five and nine blocking across here, as we mentioned before. So that has to be a two. Uh, the two blocking up here and across here puts gives us a nice little pattern of two here. So two blocking across here, across here, and up there. No, it's not going to be enough to give me a two, but I do know that twos are in those squares. Mm. Six and seven blocking this square here. Let's put six and seven over there. This has to be an eight then. Um, so that's going to give me eights in those squares. Down here, we still don't know about the eights though. We do not have any completed digits yet. So still got to do quite a lot of work here. Hmm, just can't quite seem to see it. It's like I'm almost seeing it and don't quite get there. Oh, hang on a second. Let's think about logic. 4 and 8 must be in this square here. 4 and 8 are blocked from this square here. Oh, no. I was going to say 4 and 8 must be there, but no, that's not true, is it? What is the other missing number across here? 7, right? Okay. I've got 7s in those squares. No, 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 I can't do it about the seven. Oh, it's like yuck. It's kind of, I'm almost there. I just can't 
can't grab it. I should have a quick look through. If I don't see anything, I shall switch to pencil marks. I've got a pair of sixes up here. Not anything else. Sevens, no. Hang on, hang on. What's missing from here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, right? Five, six, seven, nine in this column? Yes, so five, nine, and six here. So that's got to be a seven. Okay, that's going to help me, I'm sure. Seven across here, across here, seven up there. There's a seven. And the missing digit here is six. Uh, what do we know about sevens now? Sevens like this. Okay, so this is the only spot for a seven in this row. Uh, oh no. <laughs> I was going to tell you there's a three. There's already a three there. That's not good. Uh, still don't have any completed digits. Oh, yuck. I can't finish this game without pencil marks. I'm going to have to go to pencil marks because it's just ridiculous amounts of time that I'm spending here. Let's do it. Finish the game off. Excuse me. Sorry, uh, dear um, notation-free Sudoken people. We have to part company now.
Uh, this was 9, 5 in these squares, wasn't it? And the other number here was a 6, I think. This is, what, 2, 7? Uh, we had 7s over here. Fives here, nines somewhere there. Oh yeah, twos like this. It's a pair of, no, it's not a pair of four and nine, is it? Because we've got nine possible there still. Okay, so that's all I know um, in terms of pairs. Now, of course, this right-hand shoot is already done. There's nothing to get here. Um, let's just go across the... This is done down the bottom as well, so let's just go across the middle here. We've got... Well, let's do this. We've got a lot of candidates already in here. So two blocks up here like this. So we get to put twos in these squares. We haven't got any naked pairs or anything here, so... Uh, four, we've done five, six, seven, eight. No, it's all done, actually. That's all done, right? So let's do this middle block. We're looking for a two. Two blocks up here like this. So we get twos in those squares. Three is in four blocks across here. We get four in those squares. Five blocks up here like this. Five goes there. Six down here and across there so six in those squares and then we're looking for nine nine blocks up here so we get nine left in those squares uh, so there is a pair of two and seven here so that means that these twos cannot exist Two seven two seven. Actually, we've got a unique rectangle as well. Look at that. So that must be a six because we have two seven two seven and two six seven. So we know that that is in fact a six. So this is a five. Get rid of the fives there. So we're left with a nine. Um, that's going to put nines up here. Now, actually, we have threes in those squares there. Um, so that's a pair of three and nine. It means that's not a two. So let's place the two there. And that's not an eight. Let's place the eight there. So let's just get rid of those candidates quickly. Eight there. Two there we don't need. We'll get rid of those twos down there. We'll give ourselves a six in this square. Get rid of the sixes. We have a nine here. So this is a two which means that's a 2 up there, and we shall remove that 2, and this will be a 7. 7 up there, 2 there. Get rid of... Oh, sorry, place a 2 in that square, and uh, remove that candidate. Um, right... So the missing digit from here has got to be 5. So that puts a 5 here, 9 in that square. 3 there, 9 there. 3 means that can be deleted, and a 3 must be in that square there. We have 5 here, so this is a 1. That means you're a 1, you're a 6, you're a 1. Um, and the missing digit over here is 6, I think. 
All right, what's left to do? Uh, we've got six here, so this must be a six. Let's remove candidate six to avoid confusion. Four, eight, four, eight, four, eight, okay, and four, nine. So the four, nine blocking here means that is our four. This would be our eight, four there, eight there, four there. Four necessary in that square there, five here. Nine in this square, five in this square. And a nine is the number to finish today's Los Angeles Times expert level grid. Uh, for me, I needed pencil marks. You probably didn't, but uh, that's your prerogative. Bye-bye.